what is the future like after the United States and allies bombings in Yemen ever since the commencement of the war between Israel and Hamas things have escalated after an explosion in October 17th at a hospital in Gaza killing and injuring many the hospital blast marked the beginning of an intense militant campaign against the United States bases in the Iraq and Syria talk less of the commercial vessels passing through the Red Sea the attack forced the Allies commercial vessels to divert around the Cape of Good Hope. Mohammed Abdul Slam iterated that the Brits and the Americans are foolish and that the aggression was treacherous. What this means is that he claims the Israel war in Gaza have been dragging Middle East into more conflict. This has led to an emergence of a strong Saudi coalition and supporter of Palestinian Islamist group. That is Hamas in its war against Israel. He ins insisted that there will be more and more attacks. He claims that if there is war in Yemen, it is because of the continuous aggression from the Allies. If there is supposed to be a peace in the future of this crisis, the United Nations should urge Israel and the United States into a ceasefire, including lifting the siege on Gaza and moving towards peace and dialogue. Weighing the reasons advanced by both parties, there seemed to be a common ground for a meeting of the minds. It shouldn't be ignored. Neither should it be underestimated. 2024 still have a chance to be stabilized. And we are hoping that the minds will definitely meet leading to peaceful here and prosperity for a happier world thanks for watching our video please hit the subscribe button like and share to show your support for our vision